The Wolf Pack is back in Thailand. Hello everyone and welcome to the very first movie review on this channel. My name is Turtle and today I'm going to be reviewing Hangover 2, the sequel to a very entertaining movie which had us all laughing hysterically in 2009. Unfortunately, I found The Hangover Part 2 to be quite subpar when it came to comedy. If you haven't seen the movie, imagine watching the original movie set in Thailand. Now remove half the humor, change the nationality of the strippers, and add a 16-year-old boy. It's not as dirty as it seems. Alan, played by Zach Galifianakis, was much more hilarious in the first movie and seems to play the same character in every movie I've seen personally. The character did, however, display more intelligence, spitting out facts about Thailand and Bangkok. Bradley Cooper, playing Phil, seems much more mature, which leaves the audience wondering where the fun Phil is. Throughout the movie, Phil remains calm, cool, and collected as we would expect. However, his lack of humorous dialogue leaves this character unmemorable. Ed Helms's character Stu is consistent with the first movie, so there's not really much to say there. He didn't lose a tooth, but he is often reminded that he's not an actual doctor. You don't see much of Doug in this movie, uh, mainly because he's not a huge part of the plot. While this movie lacked originality and humor, it did maintain to keep my attention. Wondering what was going to happen next, it's still somewhat predictable, but a twist is thrown out every once in a while. For lack of consistent humor of that of the first Hangover, I'm giving this movie 6 out of 10 turtles. Yes, turtles. That about does it for my review of Hangover 2. If you have something you want to say on the movie, leave it down below, and I will see you next time. Be sure to subscribe for weekly movie reviews and other videos as well. Thank you and have a nice day.